Hi there, listener. You're about to experience Tadpog. Tyler and Dave play old games, and there will be plenty of game talk, but also copious amounts of crude, off-color, offensive, and immature speech. So if you are of a rather sensitive humor constitution, we're just letting you know what you're in for with this show. It has games. It has jokes. You know, just games and jokes. Take the games, take the jokes, and have a good time. Hello, Internet. Welcome to another Tadpog podcast, a show that happens twice a week where two old guys and one nice young lady, not rather young, nice, it's a different, it's a different, (laughs) different one. (laughs) One, one, one stern but fair <laughs> young lady. A, you're stern? I, so I about, am a little stern. Talk okay, about old right. games. I guess let's go ahead and talk what the game we're going to be talking about. It's on. The, it's one of Dave's favorites. Yeah, continuing Game, our games series. Games that Dave loves. Yeah, of, of games that Dave's love. We're going to be talking about Jaws. Mm-hmm. For the NES. For Yes, for the not, Nintendo not, Entertainment. Not Jaws Unleashed. That came out on the Xbox. No. Oh, I didn't even know that. I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't either until I did research for this show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I, I can almost guarantee you that Jaws for the NES is like a better game. And like, it has to. I mean, it looks better. <laughs> it sounds better. It's just a better game. But our special guest host today, mm-hmm. <laughs> my dear friend for many years now, Taryn Landon. Woohoo! Welcome to the show. Hi. How are we doing today? Okay, we're we're doing, right. We're right. I mean, it's okay. It's Valentine's it's Day. It's a day. Oh, <laughs> and I'm so happy to be spending my Valentine's Day with you. Yeah, this was actually that's on my list yeah. of things to ask you. How the fuck did this happen? Like, how? I don't have a Valentine. <laughs> well, Sans Valentine. So I'm gonna do Tadpog. <laughs> <laughs> the new Tadpog. <laughs> that's what? my Valentine. I went to work and I'm gonna do Tadpog. Yeah, I mean, no, that's, no, that's no, essentially I what would, I did today. Believe me, I would much rather be spending it with you two gentlemen. <laughs> Because you recently started listening to the show. Absolutely. Like, yes. I want to do one. I was like, well, what games do you like? Yes. And you reeled off a list. And I, I was like, that's the one Dave really wants you to did. do. You did. You said Jaws. Let's do that. Yep. It's a good game. It's an awesome game. It's a I'm going to make the noises in a minute. All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where they go down. Yeah. I love it. I love that. Wait, I thought that's that, Kirby's noise. No, no, Kirby... no. Where they drop, where they, he goes down into the water. Oh, okay. Where they drop him into okay. the water. <laughs> 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 it's so great. But, I wish you could see me do <laughs> Yeah, he's got hand motions and everything. It's pretty, pretty elaborate. But I'm your bearded host, Tyler. And hey, Tyler. tell me a little something about yourself. I mentioned last week that I would talk about online girlfriends. Yeah, that was online that was girlfriends. yeah, yeah. Oh boy. So I have Palace Chat. I had one one more serious online girlfriend. That the other one was just like we talked on Yahoo Messenger, and she gave me her phone number, and I called her once, and that was it. But the that's other pretty one, serious. Well, the other one, one pretty serious for an internet relationship. Mm-hmm. Uh, the other one, her name was Tiffy. Okay. So we call, that's what we called her. Did she take her clothes off for money? She may now. I don't mm. know. It's been, it's her been many years. Tiffy. Does it sound like? Tiffy. <laughs> I've never met a Tiffy. But I met Tiffy on, I think, Palace Chat, and then that became Yahoo Messenger, and then that became exchanging phone numbers. Mm-hmm. So we would call each other, and then exchanging addresses, so we would send pictures and letters. What would and, you send pictures of? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Were they good? I am. I am not the most photogenic person. Like I'll, I'll reference for Taryn here because I I photograph like Chandler Bing. Oh. I've got the bedroom eyes. It's like yeah, it's it's terrible. So she writes me a letter, sends me like she's very pretty, and she sends me like. Well, the the Three. photograph of the girl that the she sent was, was, was pretty. The girl that she sent was pretty. The girl in the photo was pretty. We don't know about her. Uh, <laughs> so Tiffy. Tiffy, meanwhile, Tiffy might just have been divorced a his wife <laughs> of 40 years. <laughs> and, like, I think Tiffy, we, I was, like, 14 maybe, and, like, she had just gotten out of her. She was also, like, 14 and just gotten out of her serious relationship and was very right. heartbroken. Yeah, let's put 14 <laughs> air quotes. 14, 14-year-olds have very serious relationships. So, like... Everything that I said, she just fucking ate it up, like, and then just it exacerbated until you know all that stuff happens. So then I'm looking over, like, God, what photos do I want to send? What's a good photo of me? Like, I find one, the one where I look okay, but it's the picture of me and my family for the church annual. <laughs> Church so, so I do you send, have that? So I do send, we have that photograph? I mean, oh, I it's gotta be around it. somewhere yeah. in my mom's. But I sent her that one. <laughs> um, I was like, I, we need like a funny one. So I'm looking through pictures, and there's one picture of it's at a youth group 
uh, we went camping at uh, Hillman's Ferry Campground, and for some reason somebody had a stuffed squirrel, and that was like our mascot for the week. Like taxidermy? Mm. Or? Yeah. Like a, yeah. Like a, no, real, oh, like really? a real taxidermy I was, squirrel. I was joking. <laughs> like a real taxidermy squirrel. So it was like hard as a rock. Yeah. yeah. So oh. we have it setting out, and there's like... I have a rope tied to it, and then I'm in an inner tube and act like it's pulling me. Yeah. And Classic, like, You're Tyler. so yeah. clever, <laughs> Tyler. Like, she's going to be funny. But then, like, somebody else pointed out to me later, I have a Tommy Hilfiger shirt on. And it says, <laughs> Amazing. It has, just says Tommy on the front. Right. But I am bent over at such an angle <laughs> that it says Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm, this is when I'm, like, heavier set. Oh. So, like, fat guy in an inner tube with a squirrel with my shirt that says Tommy. Oh, across, boy. Across so I sent that to her. Can we, do you have that? I want that you have photo. that photograph? I, I don't care that, about the church probably, book photo. That's probably lost yeah. of the ages. Can that's, we tweet that to Tommy Hilfiger? I want Hilfiger. the squirrel it's you're just hiding it. You're such a liar. <laughs> it's I, in a box. I would love if we found that. I would love to find I, that. I'm going to tweet that, that, that to Tommy Hilfiger. Yes, and like, please. And like make him quit. <laughs> yes. This is what used to produce Tommy Hilfiger. <laughs> but I remember Tiffy, like, we called back and forth. Like, I would buy name. phone no. cards. Let's call her something different. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Tiffany? You want to call Tiffany. her Tiffany? That's a good Tiffany was a friend, Tiffany. but she went as Tiffany. She lived a few counties over, so it wasn't, like, ridiculous that we'd ever meet. But when you're 14, like... Two hours away is still like, yeah, yeah, it's not going to happen. Um, so we had planned, hopefully, when our basketball teams would like meet when we would, that's when we would actually see each other, but it never happened. But she wrote me like, actually, she wrote me a beautiful poem one time. And I kept. Did she rip it off from Garfield? Mm. <laughs> that's all good poetry comes from. <laughs> but I remember I saved it. And then eventually, like, the calling card, you know, we'd, I'd buy calling cards. Eventually, you know, everything just fizzled out. Man, you bought calling cards. Wow. That shit is That's serious. The only, that wow. was like, I mean. Well, we didn't have like area calling cell phones right, sort of right, thing. Right. So yeah. I no, if that had been Facebook, you'd have been Facebook official yeah. by yeah. buying those calling cards. Yes. Went, and see, but I worked, this was back when I worked at the Executive Inn and I got a discount on. You worked at the Executive Inn? I didn't Inn. know that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> My first job was busing tables at the Executive Inn. Wow. And, but I got a discount on phone cards there, but there were fucked up phone cards because every time you would call somebody, it took five minutes off to initiate off it, the to, call. Yeah, that's, yeah. I had some like that too. Yeah. yeah. So, but eventually, you know, fizzled out. I hadn't talked to her in a long time, and I got um, my sophomore year, uh, my my first official, you know, serious girlfriend in high school. And but she always wanted me to write her poetry. Like she wanted to write it. So not bad. Tiffany. This is not. <laughs> this, this is not, not a different Tiffany. girl than Tiffany. This is not this, Tiffany. This is another girl. This is yeah. You know. I know. Who her, she okay. Is. <laughs> yeah, Ter- Ter- Terrence familiar with her. <laughs> I'm in one. This <laughs> one. And she always wanted me to write her poetry. I was like, I'm not. I'm not a fucking poet. This is not, this is I'm not, not a good a thing. Poet. But she was like, I'm an inner tube writer, <laughs> not a poet. It came around to like an, one of our anniversaries or something like that, and she wanted me to write her a poem, and I was like, oh, fuck. And I was clicking on my computer, and I found the poem that Tiffy wrote me. Right, Tiffany. Tiffany wrote me. Yeah, let's go. So through. I just please don't say Tiffany yeah, again. We don't like that. <laughs> I just changed out my name with her name. Oh, and Tyrone. Forwarded that shit on, and she loved it. She licked it up, didn't yeah, she? Yep. Yeah. Because it was it was a really good poem. You bastard. And then eventually, Shia buffed it. <laughs> Shia buffed it. Yeah. I, re- I remember she was on my computer one day and got on my email and saw that it was actually from. Tiffy, and she had heard... She was heard, in your email. It's her she'd, fault. She'd heard me what talk about bitch. Tiffy before, and she was insanely jealous From someone <laughs> of my who internet 14. girlfriend I never met when I was 14. <laughs> she, was, she was incensed about it. Sounds about Marshall County, right? Got Tiffy's email from that yeah. and emailed her fucking going off on her. Just bitched her out in this email. Poor Tiffy. And the, so the last I ever heard of Tiffy was her responding to my ex-girlfriend's email saying, wow. I feel sorry for Tyler. Hope he has a nice life. And that was it. You might have, you might have want to stuck with Tiffy because that's yeah. about right. Yeah. That's about right. If you or anyone you know have any information <laughs> about, about the whereabouts, whereabouts of, of Tiffy, I, I've searched Please her call. up and down on Facebook. <laughs> oh, I have cannot you? find her. But because she probably doesn't go by Tiffy. Well, I've searched her Tiffany. <laughs> 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 Tiffany? Why is there no Tiffany on the Facebook? You just keep typing it in like uppercase letters. Tiffy, Tiffy, Tiffy. Tiffy. Maybe Tiffy with an IE. <laughs> how do I write it in cursive? That's, what, that's how she wrote it. Oh, so But no, sweet I've searched Lord. for her full her full first and last name. There are a lot of them. Just and Google poetry like, with it. <laughs> I've messaged yeah. five of them like, hey. Hey. Would, <laughs> were we internet boyfriend and girlfriend? <laughs> nope, not me. Nope, nope, not me. So Nope. That's funny. That's a good story. <laughs> that is so, a good story. That's a great story. 
bastard though for recycling that poem. <laughs> uh, she wanted she wanted everything like artificial in a relationship. We had to talk on the phone six hours a day. She wanted poetry. That's she some wanted terrible notes. business. Yeah, that sounds pretty. She's got six hours to talk on the phone. She oh, oh my god, that's why I don't like to talk on the phone now. Like a person has so many hours I in their lifetime to a lot to time on the phone. Yeah. You've made I your burn it out up on her. Yeah. So. Yeah, you've used them all. Yep. Mm-mm. Right on. Just like you're using your mic time on Tadpog. Yep. Like, <laughs> like when you're done with this, you're never going to speak into a microphone again. <laughs> we'll, we'll, go, we'll go around the table. Kind of oh, clockwise. Oh, I like it. Yeah. Change it up. Do I need to tell a story about an internet boyfriend? Yeah. If that's what you want to do, yeah. Oh, well, I can do that. I say that. yeah. I think we um, should. I've dated two people that I met offline, actually. Um, and fairly seriously, I dated one from Detroit for a minute, and I met him. Well, I mean, I, I physically met him. In person as well, but um, we never lived in the same area. Um, I mean, he always lived in Detroit, and I always lived in Nashville. And we went, we would meet and go to shows together, and we dated very seriously for probably seven or eight months. So when you say go to shows, that Dave is something, that is something I'm sorry. very important about I you. I am so sorry. Yeah, we skipped all over that. I'm a huge, <laughs> huge Dave Matthews Band fan. Uh, I'm up to 104 shows currently. It's a lot of shows. It's a lot of shows. I'm about I to love go to them. my fifth. <gasps> fifth. <laughs> fifth show. We'll make you a sign. Uh-huh. Dave, this is his fifth, fifth show. show. <laughs> Um, no, I've done it for about 11 years now, 11 and a half years. My first show was actually in Nashville, Tennessee mm. that my mom drove me to because I did not have a license. <laughs> when was that? Uh, 2001 was my first show. Okay. I, I did have a permit, but she would not, she didn't even want me to drive. I mean, that's the big city. That's the naughty big city in <laughs> yeah, Nashville. Yeah, yeah. And uh, Some I dude's going to steal your poem up there. And try, use steal it my poem. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, 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 we went to my first show and... Um, a friend of mine passed out on my feet, and another friend of mine and his girlfriend fought the entire time, and I never saw them, so I was pretty much alone, mm. and I was just completely and utterly hooked. And I uh, went home that night, got the emergency family credit card, and bought <laughs> tickets to the St. Louis show for the next week. Nice. Um, got benched five games from cheering because I went to a Dave Matthews Band show, and I missed cheerleading practice. Oh, God. The thing about, about Taryn... Taryn was the most popular girl oh, in my high school. Oh, sweet lord. <laughs> well, I can't believe we had the most popular girl oh in our school. Oh, most popular girl. Most popular girl. Most <laughs> I've slowly just, I mean, how the mighty have fallen. I've <laughs> taken, <laughs> just taken and dragged you down to this level. You have not dragged me anywhere. <laughs> I am more, I, you know, I, I mean, not, not a gloating thing, but I was in, we, I was fairly popular, you know, Jacob, or whatever. Back in high school days, oh, please Jacob, tell this. Jacob York this described favorite. you. Jacob York of, of Wolf Fighting Fame. Wolf Fighting Fame has yes. described you as masturbatory gold. And I still love that term, <laughs> masturbatory gold. Uh, Which he may not think that now. God bless him. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm sorry. Getting back to the, I, we got off topic. But I followed Dave Matthews Band. I have for a long time, and um, I went to a show by myself when I was 20 in Las Vegas, your favorite yeah, city. That's yes, where I started one of my favorite. As, as everyone jazz knows about the masturbating in Vegas. <laughs> I'm telling um, the porn is free. There. I'm it's so great. It's great, and they. Slap it at you, and they you just it's <laughs> I mean, that so did, amazing. I would have been for that. That didn't happen uh, to me, but <laughs> it's amazing. I mean, they, and they're not well, the girls in the cards, they're not bad looking. I'd hate to see what they actually sent you if you ordered one of the girls from the cards, but yeah, I you know, I didn't have the family emergency credit card, yeah. otherwise, I could probably <laughs> yeah. answer that. And it was not for Dave Matthews <laughs> tickets, by the way. Um, but yeah, I went to a show by myself when I was 20 in Las Vegas, and uh, actually. Our friend Brandon was the one that of pointed Ax- me. Of Axley fame, of, okay, right? sorry, I don't know which one he was on. Axley, yeah, I didn't listen to that one. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck not you, because, Brandon. Not because of Brandon. I didn't listen <laughs> to that fuck one. Fuck you, Brandon. You hear fuck that? Fuck you, Jonas. <laughs> uh, but anyway, yeah, he had pointed me in the direction of a message board called UFCK, which I'm sure he mm. he might have spoken about it, and because they have a gamer thread on there, and um, he said you need to get on this message board because they have a big DMB side. And, you know, you'd probably meet some people and get some good contacts for shows and stuff. And I was like, cool. So I got on it. And um, I and I was 20 years old, like I said. I went to Vegas by myself. And I posted on the DMB side. And it said, uh, you know, I'm 20. And, I, you know, I'm really not, I'm not going to be able to gamble or anything like that. I had a fake ID. And I drank a little mm. bit on it. But, um, you know, I wasn't going to gamble. Because my luck, it would be like Ve- <laughs> Vegas vacation where he wins a car, wins a car, wins a car. And <laughs> I have a fake ID. And I'm like, yeah, I'm Papa George. Yeah, I, think, I, think that, I think that also happened in Full House. I did. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yes. Yes, exactly. Yeah. But so, I, you know, I wasn't gaming or anything, but my, I had friends that messaged me on there and they're like, you know, that kind of worries us. It, 
you're by yourself and you're 20, you know, meet up with us. We're not weirdos. We're not yeah. crazies. That's what they all that's say. That's, that's, that's just what I've met would some say. crazies online, <laughs> let me tell you. But these, these guys I had generally, you know, they, they seem very sweet. And so I went and met them before the show. So just in case if they were crazy, I could go to the show and never deal with them again. Right. And good, I ended up meeting, meeting the guy that night that I ended up dating for mm. a while. Um, and then actually my... My past very serious relationship that just ended a few months ago, we met online. Mm -hmm. And we dated. I mean, we knew each other for almost six years. Followed Dave together forever. He was just my buddy. And then uh, we ended up going to an event together and hitting it off. And we dated for a little over two and a half years. And lived long distancely. And then he moved to Nashville. Oh, yeah? Yeah, mm -hmm. and he still lives there. But we no longer are mm -hmm. together. Mm -hmm. Don't make me throw your microphone because <laughs> so, it might yeah, get yeah, violent. Just, I'm, I'm it might get violent. Did you, the subject, did you see the air just yeah, get real? Just... Oh, things got real fucking Ooh. tense. Like, to the point where I was like, uh, you know, the first Dave shows I saw <laughs> yeah. were in Nashville just, and St. Louis just, as well. Let's flip the script here. <laughs> no, nah, you know, we're, it's going to get better. It's still kind of a fresh wound, though. And, mm -hmm. you know, that's what happens when I break up. But, Fuck, I sure wish I'd have known yeah. that before I said anything about Valentine's Day. Oh, I'm not upset about Valentine's Day. I'm like, I'm oh, a I'm big not. fucking asshole. Valentine's Day has never been, you know, it's a so big holiday. Valentine's with that big, fresh heart <laughs> What the fuck are you doing no. with us? No, no, no. Valentine's Day has never been a huge uh, holiday for me anyway. I, I think you can love anybody anytime, so I don't need a card that says that. Mm -hmm. And I hate flowers. I hate them. Are you allergic? No, I just think it's a huge waste of money. It is. If They're you're going to drop $90 yeah. on something, buy me a fucking pair of shoes. <laughs> it, I, that's another one of my habits but shoes buy me some shoes man like <laughs> i'm dave your bespectacled host and um taryn i try i've had like two pots of coffee today i'm in love that you just started <laughs> drinking coffee by the way i i'm but i i'm still chasing that dragon like i can't yeah. i can't re, I, I can't i just can't get to where i was you're never the, gonna reach like that high time. again my friend and it's like i'm this this is like the end of a second pot yeah and i feel i feel normal now which isn't so good oh i know it's like I, it up. I need to like i need some like meth. cocaine or oh, meth yeah or well something. we are in western kentucky <laughs> right, yeah. so meth should be easily I could, accessible I could, I could throw a stone in <laughs> yes. a meth house uh, meth, we there, just shut out the window because <laughs> like three miles on the road there's a there's a bridge and a strip club so right. somewhere somebody's somewhere got there. some meth I, I live in a really classy neighborhood <laughs> <laughs> your house is beautiful <laughs> There is definitely some meth, though, if you're ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I think I'm actually, you're ready. The, the shed in my backyard kind of <laughs> looks like a, yeah, I We mean, can make some. <laughs> yeah, well, all right. Surely we can Google it. Let's I mean, <laughs> I've got Breaking Bad. On. Yeah, I, wanna, yes. I want that yes. Google search. We will How get, do I make meth? How do I Yahoo make Yahoo answers. And freaking Aaron Paul pops up. Yeah. And it just says, yeah, bitch. <laughs> We're going to get those fucking shoes. <laughs> yes. We're going to get them. <laughs> I, um, I had a... I wouldn't say a lot of online girlfriends, but I did meet a lot of girls in high school online. Mm -hmm. I mentioned before, I used to be like a real, I used to be an IRC, real hardcore. Do either mm -hmm. of you know what that is? It's like some nerdy ass chat. <laughs> yeah. Like, like when, in the 90s, like yeah, you yeah. had to fucking know computers in order to, be to that was a, that was this the shit deep up. Net. Yeah. Um, and there was a public local channel in there called Cloud yeah. that, a, that a dude I knew in high school, a friend of mine, started up. So, like, all these people from all like, to Paducah Tillman and all these other schools that anyone listening doesn't fucking know about no. um, would all meet up and chat. And I've got an asshole story since you told an asshole story, Tyler. About you being an asshole or someone's asshole. Uh, I pretended to be a girl named Tiffy. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Your poetry is beautiful. You're beautiful. It, it moved you, didn't it? Yes, it did. <laughs> good. Your poetry is stunning. <laughs> and I, you know, I knew this. I knew this good-looking girl and, and asked her if I could circle. take her photograph. And I sent it. <laughs> and then I got this really nasty email one day, and I just fucking and I just quit all ties. The got whole of this, of this guy's family and a picture of a tummy <laughs> shirt and a dead squirrel on a string. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that didn't that didn't deter me at all. But I um. All right, so this this local girl, she starts talking. We start talking, and she seems pretty cool. And she is, she wants to meet, right? I'm like, okay, let's do this. And like, let's do this. Craigslist didn't exist yet, but I'm like, let's do this Craigslist style in case you are a 40 year old man right? who's just gonna give me the church basement. Um, <laughs> yeah. So we decided to meet at a blockbuster, right? And so I so I go to the blockbuster, and I'm there, and I'm checking out movies, and um. 
I had a, like a vague description. God, I don't, I really, I'm, I'm like halfway in the story and I don't want to finish it. <laughs> oh my, no, you're in it that now. That sounds good. You're in too deep, no, buddy. No, it's good. Uh, I kind of like, she never sent me any photographs or anything. God, this is awful. <laughs> it's okay. She just told me like a, a pretty basic description of yeah. what she looked like. Uh, let me just say, very lovely girl now. <laughs> you actually know her now. Uh, we're Facebook friends. Okay, all right. Uh, very lovely girl now. Uh, however, when I when I saw her come in the door, I was like, "No, this is not gonna. <laughs> this is this is not this is not gonna." I didn't say anything. I was just like, uh, "Yeah, I'm looking at this movie," and like I waited until like she. I, I could see. I, I, I'm such an asshole because like I see her like you looking can around. See her doing yeah, yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So are you see- texting each other? No, what are you doing? I, I didn't have texting. a cell phone. Oh, okay, time, I'm yeah. sorry, I didn't know the timeline yeah. here. No, no, it was just like, yeah. no, it's worse than that. Oh, it's worse than that you because, were like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like before before she left the house, she's like, okay, I'm going now. And then, yeah, she walked in. I see her looking around. I was like, I know that's her. I don't think this is gonna work. Wow. <laughs> so I, I bailed. Oh. Yeah, I bailed and then uh, totally lied about it. What an when ass. I, I know, right? I was there. I didn't see you. No, 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 no. I said Did something you? came up. Couldn't make it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I totally lied. So I couldn't, I couldn't do it, man. What an ass. I, right? And I'm being pressured to find a man yeah. and look at what you're doing. <laughs> look at what you're out doing. Hey, I've learned, I've learned my lesson. Yeah. I've grown a lot. Yes. Well, this was. A I was now. David, I was. David I was finger banged every girl he meets in a blockbuster. Now I was. Well, and they closed the motherfuckers, I, so like my streak is over. I managed a blockbuster for two years. I love those places. Dirty things happen. I mean, I was 15. Yeah. I'm forgiven, right? That's fair. Yeah. Oh, I, I, absolutely. I said she's lovely. Yeah, she, right? said I did, she was I did, lovely. I, right, I, she's I, lovely. No. no. <laughs> she's lovely on Facebook. <laughs> I, I, I paid penance. <laughs> I know a lot of people yeah, that are lovely yeah. on Facebook. Yeah, well, yeah I've, you know. done, I've done shittier, shittier things. Like, they, like the girl who asked, like, don't tell anybody we did this. <laughs> <gasps> so... Well, I didn't tell her I loved yeah. her either. Yeah, you did that. You've got some back episodes. Yeah, to to. Oh, oh, I do. I'm going. Thanks, <laughs> thanks for making me feel a little better. Tomorrow, I'm listening to back episodes. <laughs> awesome. All right, so now we're only 22 minutes in. <laughs> only. <laughs> only. Only. I'm long-winded, so you need to just cut me off whenever you tell me to. All right, we got to talk about Jaws. All right. So <laughs> we got to do it. Okay. So Jaws. Okay. Jaws. <laughs> <laughs> that that could be the noise then. To bring in the, up the Dave reads from Wikipedia. Segment. Oh, is this the Wiki? I love this part. All right, guys. Thanks. You Does it make the noise? It <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and there's actually an audio, audio file linked. No, there's not. Oh, did you see my yeah. face? I, I know, it was I like know. you gave me a pony yeah, and then you took I it away. Like, <laughs> yeah. Well, you and that girl at Blockbuster. I mean, you, oh, you have so something sad. in common now. I, I've disappointed both of you. <laughs> I'm so sad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, Jaws is a video game for the Nintendo Entertainment System that is loosely based on the film franchise of the same name. <laughs> yeah. No way. Off, off to a rough start already. <laughs> loosely based. <laughs> loosely. Because there might be a different Jaws. <laughs> um, it's also one of the few LJN published titles developed by a Japanese company. Hmm. Um there was a separate computer adaptation of the original Jaws movie called Jaws the Computer Game. Um, they are completely different. Mm. And that's pretty much all they have to say. This is a very short Wikipedia entry. Usually okay. they're very long. Usually they are long, but I'll tell you what. Um, Taryn, I think you and I are the only people on the internet who like this game. <laughs> I love this game. <laughs> I love it. When I sent, when he asked me what my favorite games were, yeah, and I sent him a list, and he didn't know one of them, which I was shocked yeah. by. Which one? Russian Attack. Uh, I'm familiar with okay. it. I've never played I it. I love though. that. I never game. played it. But then I said Jaws, and then we were talking about how I wanted to come and do a show, and he was like, "You got to come because Dave loves Jaws." Yeah, I had just mentioned Jaws. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. Tyler and sent me a message. He's like, "Taryn likes Jaws." I love Jaws. Um, my best friend Darcy and I. Uh, she's a, still a fabulous. She's fabulous. Still amazing girl. And not just Facebook fabulous. We she had yeah, not just Facebook <laughs> right, okay. fabulous. I always was very jealous because I always wanted a basement house and I never had one. We always lived in a one story house. Yeah, because I'm an only child and it's just me, my mom, and dad. So and basement houses are rare here. It, yeah, because and of water exactly. Yeah. and I was so pumped because my best friend Darcy had a basement house, so we would go into her basement and just get hunkered down in there and play Nintendo for hours. Yeah, and mm-hmm. Jaws was one of our favorites. It's and a good game. I think we liked it just because we liked the movie. I mean, I remember watching the movie when yep. I was little. Well, this could have been called Shark Shooter, and it would have been pretty similar. Well, yeah. yeah I mean, yeah. And I'm fine with yeah. that. But, I mean, Shark like the shooter. whole... I'm fine with that. Yeah. I remember that. Uh, they, um, the, like, the noises and the sounds and then how difficult it was. Like, it's not an easy game. No. 
I never I mean, beat it as a kid. No, I yeah, I, I haven't either. And now I've went back and watched because Tyler's recommendation was to mm. watch gameplay videos to because I I still have my NES, but I do not have the Jaws game anymore. And a bunch of them got stolen. Game Galaxy has yeah, it. Five dollars. I, I bet they do. Um, <laughs> I saw it the last uh, yep. time we were up there. And I need to go there. It's been a while since I went. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's in my hometown, so mm-hmm. or my town. Um, but they, um, I just remember us sitting there for hours trying to beat that game. And I just loved it. It's such a fun game. I remember the first time I played it. I didn't own it, which yeah. is a shame. I didn't I either. Loved it was it hers. So much. Yeah. And I remember I used to have to go with my parents all the time, yeah. like their friends from work and stuff like that. And like sometimes I would luck out and their friends would have like a kid. Right. And then sometimes I would get even luckier and that kid would have a Nintendo. Yep. This was like one of those situations well, where yeah. um, we went over to some someone's house yeah they had a kid who was like at summer camp or something and i just got to go through all their nintendo oh, games. oh you lucky and i played it. jaws for like yeah six hours yeah. that night while they played poker or whatever yeah. but um and that's that's how my love of yeah. game started right yeah. well she it was hers because she had an older sister and they they had tons of games mm. and i was an only child and i didn't have that many yeah, yeah. and i mean not that i i just didn't buy a ton of them you know but they bought them all the time i've never seen the movie oh <gasps> I never played the game until I, I beat it wrong? a few years Why ago. Why do you let him on this? He's never seen Jaws. <laughs> it's not a movie podcast. Yeah, it, that, <laughs> I know, that, but to it's be still. fair, to be fair, <laughs> still. Because <laughs> have you seen like Meg the Wizard is, of Oz? I mean, Meg has been That's on second breakfast. Yeah. Meg has been on second breakfast. I have not. So second breakfast a, being a movie podcast. Movie podcast. <laughs> oh, okay, all yeah. right. That yeah, I've seen Wizard of Oz. We said it was okay. like like it was ours. The movie <laughs> podcast. Yeah, sorry, second breakfast is the movie. The movie podcast. We do that on off days. Yeah, that's it. That's your yeah. other gig, right? Yeah. But then that's I I had read earlier that this Jaws game was based on Jaws four. Yeah, the revenge. <laughs> but kind of. How not many really. times is the I shark mean, like Wolverine? Does it regenerate over time? Like, well, he does in the game. In the game, yeah, he does, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna go with yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. So Wolverine. Shark. I mean, but he's okay. gone in the that's movie. Cool. The that's only not, he's not in. Oh, the okay. only real tie. The. There's two real ties to Jaws of Revenge. Okay, this game has, mm-hmm. and that is the way you kill Jaws at the end of the game, which is you ram the what, what's the front of the boat? The oh, bow. Yeah, yeah, the bow. Yeah. You ram the bow through Jaws. Friends reference. Through Jaws. Jaws's chest. <laughs> Jaws's. Jaws's. Uh, the second is the game. The art on the game cover looks a lot like the art for the movie poster. Yeah, that's it's it. The, that's yeah, it. Yeah, it's the. Okay. Beyond that, you're just With shooting. Mouth. You're just shooting. Yeah, you just shoot sharks and stingrays yeah. and jellyfish. Yeah, and then I you started, pick up the seashells and yeah. The, yeah, yeah, and you get points and stuff like that. Because yeah, apparently, like yeah, you start out and you're scuba diver on a boat. Mm-hmm. Uh, the world has flooded and it is now in a shell based economy. Um, it is a shell based economy. Mm-hmm. Maybe it's just the ocean, dog. Maybe um, maybe it's just maybe it's just. I ocean. like to imagine sort of water world. Well, you, I, like, I, I like. didn't think the, it was that in depth. Yeah, <laughs> I never got yeah, that. I don't. <laughs> I don't think they went that. Clear. I never rescued Kevin Costner. <laughs> no, enough. I think you are Kevin no. Costner. <laughs> I don't think so because, well, I mean, to be honest, this game probably sold more than a lot of his movies. That's probably true. <laughs> Burn Kevin Costner. Burn Kevin hey, Costner. Look, call us hey, in. Hey, look, man, I don't have a problem with Kevin Costner. No. All, I'm, all I'm saying, I, I mean. I love the guy. Love the guy. He and I go way back. Yeah. Um, but all I'm saying is Old that he's friend. in a lot of yeah. movies that, that tank. are terrible. Yeah. I mean, they just mm. tank. Yeah. You're right. So I don't know. You're right. I he hear took he's my girl Jen to... down on a couple of movies, too, <laughs> they, that they've been in together. Yeah. By Jen, I mean my friend Jen Aniston. We're oh, best right, friends. Yeah, right, we're right. best friends. So it's yeah. like it's like Darcy at the top. Darcy and then, then, and then right, Jen. They're right below. Jen Aniston. Jen. <laughs> yes. Absolutely. Well, um, I will say this: the game looks yeah. good. Yeah, for the NES. you like how it looks. It yes. looks good and it runs very smoothly. That's what we always yeah. liked how it looked. I had never any. It was it was it was made well. Yeah, it sounds good. I love that. <laughs> Don't make me. I'm not <laughs> doing the noise again. No, like I like no shit. Like I. Well, I, I like like the intense music. Like yeah, when yeah, you, yeah. When they drop you off, and yeah. then When you pick up the sonar, and then you can hear you can hear Jaws better when you get the sonar. Yeah, and yeah. When you go into the port and stuff. Oh, I love it. Yeah. The best music in the game, and this is honestly. Uh, Listeners have asked before for like our favorite game music, and I forgot about this song. There's a there's a bonus stage in the yep. game where you fly a, <laughs> you fly a Cessna. I think we it's, like this game a lot. <laughs> yes, and you and you you drop cannonballs yep. from your Cessna onto jellyfish yep. that are coming up, and it's uh, really good music. The music right. is it's the, it's the best. Yeah. It's up there with like the moon theme from Ducktales. Well, because Meg asked me, she's like, "What are you playing, Jaws?" Are you sure not playing like Mega Man or something? Nope. nope. Jaws. I'm Straight just, I'm just Jaws. in a plane dropping cannonballs on yep. jellyfish. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a departure. It's a departure. It's it's smart design because the rest of the music is all like these minor chords yeah. and yeah. it's like really intense. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This music lets you know 
that this is a different part of the game. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You're but safe. This is just a fun game. You're safe. It's a fun part. Because <laughs> you can't die in the bonus. It's like playing shuffleboard true. on the deck or something. Yeah, you're, you're just cool. having a you're great cool. time. You're just having a great time. <laughs> Free buffet. But because I had no idea what <laughs> the fuck was going on because all of a sudden I'm in a boat and you hit something. Yeah. And you I'm hit. in water and then like stingrays are coming at me, jellyfish. Yeah. Okay. The occasional and then little small sharks. Small sharks, yeah. Let and me, you know when it's and jaws. And then fucking jaws. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, I feel like I didn't do a, good, do a good job setting the game up. Okay, set it okay. up. Okay, so let me set it up. This game is essentially a space shooter that takes place in the ocean, mm-hmm. but it has RPG elements wrapped up to it. So tell me what the fuck is not to like, because everything is everything is is great. First of all, I'm going to use wonderful adjectives like that. Uh, there's it starts out in an overworld, right? Yep. Everything's everything is top down. You're in your boat. You're in water world. And you're sailing around. <laughs> Kevin Costner's waving Kevin at you. Kevin Costner's, yeah. <laughs> He's hanging out, really bummed yeah. that the world is flooded. He's drinking his pee. <laughs> Him and Bear Grylls just oh, hanging out. Lord. <laughs> drinking pee. Because that's what they do. So now, I'm on, do. now I'm on board. Now you're ready for the game. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you, well, you don't drive a boat. What do you do? You sail a boat? You it, sail but it's a, not a sailboat. But it's, it's not like a, a sailboat. Yeah, it's like a yacht. I mean... You, your boat. It's a schooner. <laughs> it's a schooner. <laughs> You dumb bastard. <laughs> uh, you'll you'll just float around. Yeah. And then you'll be taken to a random encounter. You'll hit something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you'll hit you'll yeah. And then I, it switches from the overview and, and you go to like a side view. Yeah. And you're scuba Steve. <laughs> you're and, scuba Steve. And manta rays or sorry, stingrays come yes. at come at you from Not either manta side. Rays. Not manta rays, please. <laughs> I, I apologize to any manta ray <laughs> listeners. <laughs> I, I swear I'm not racist. I, I know the difference between you manta rays and you stingrays. Uh, we all look the same, but you didn't. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that, Ray. Back off. Back off of me, Ray family. And, and then jellyfish, they come up from the bottom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If anything hits you, you die. Yeah. Um, and then you, so you, you shoot mm-hmm. these creatures, these sea creatures with your harpoon gun. Mm-hmm. Well, spoke, well, you have a gun. Although I never see anything come out of the gun. What's well, a harpoon like, gun? The gun is slightly pointed downward, and you're basically shooting spears out of your eyes. It's like you are a spear throwing cyclops, like just out of your eyes, and you've got the mm. gun. Yeah, I don't point, know. Point I don't, slightly Tyler, below we don't, you. We don't no. believe you. I nice don't, try. I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> nice try. John, you're really trying to turn I it mean, into I something really, that's not. I know, There's no, right? It's not freaking Waterworld, Tyler, yeah. okay? Yeah, yeah. It's not Waterworld. It's Jaws. <laughs> so it's you, Jaws. you kill these creatures. <laughs> And they either drop a crab. Uh, yep. Yeah, that scuttles start. away. That scuttles away yep. on the, the ocean floor. Yep. Thank you for my freedom. <laughs> <laughs> right? um, and, and he's very hard to catch. Yeah. If you catch, if you him, catch him, you get like a really mediocre amount of points. Yeah, like, it's, it's not really, good enough for trying just, to catch just him. Just let that fucker go yeah. is my, my pro tip. Yeah. Second thing they'll drop is a starfish. Yes. That's where the shitload of points. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, which points may not seem important, but they are. But they are. Um, and then the third item that a creature might drop is a shell. Shell. And you you meant you touched on this tile. It looks like the rainbow shell. Whenever I saw it. Yeah, I can I can I'm on board with that. Yeah. Chrono trigger, Chrono trigger. Earthbound. Yeah. <laughs> you you listen to some more back episodes. There. You're yeah. Like, ah, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna check I out. I like that look of confusion. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Oh, that's <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um. But yeah, you, you buy everything in the game with shells. Everything. There's yeah. no money. There, yeah. You buy with the shells. So you want the shells. Mm-hmm. You want you need the, the shells. The starfish are the points, but you really you gotta have the shells. You can't feed your family unless you mm-hmm. go out. Gotta get on your boat. Kevin Costner's not shells. getting a sandwich <laughs> if you don't get some fucking shells. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you buy with the shells? Well, I know you pull into, you have to alternate ports. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go back and There's yeah. two yeah. ports. Two ports. Mm-hmm. You cr- cruise into a port yeah. and like happy music sounds yeah. and like your power goes up. Your power level. Yep, your yep. level, yeah. Yeah. So it's, I guess it's somewhat Dragon Ball Z-ish. Like mm-hmm. your power level goes up. Your and power level goes up. Yeah, here are five shells. And then you can leave again and mm-hmm. go to the other port and do it again and do it again and do it and again. And the whole time, the fin is behind you. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do, 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 You'll do, see, do, I want to see Jaws. Right, the, first, the first time you get the uh, the sonar. Yes. yes. Where my and fin? then you start getting power ups. I know, what's wrong? <laughs> I have a, it's from a Jimmy Buffett concert. I have oh, a fin. Oh, you have a fin, for real? Yes. Of course. Well, what? Come on. I know. I, I come dropped on, the ball. You gotta... <laughs> I dropped the ball. <laughs> That's all right. Sorry. That's okay. It's your first time. I know. It's your first time. Never again <laughs> will I forget my costume for the, Tyler, let's for never, the podcast. Let's, let's never invite her back. Okay? Sorry. Mm-hmm. I'm Don't sorry. Fin. Everybody else brought a fin. Yeah, Everybody know, else right? has got a fin, Taryn. <laughs> Do you know the rules? <laughs> it's costumes only on the podcast. 
Uh, I thought killing the sting- stingrays got a little difficult because you have to be right on the same plane as them. Yeah. Yeah, you have to be level. I, like right. Yeah. yeah. It's coming at you, so you you can your maneuverability is pretty good. Yeah, it, inertia is kind of a bitch because it's all underwater. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. like the faster you move, the harder it is to stop. And that's yeah. usually what'll kill me is like yeah. I'll, I'll be going You'll, too fast yeah. and I'll slide into slide a right fucking past, jelly. Yeah, and chase a crab. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. Bump. Never yeah. chase a crab. Until you get Don't chase a crab. Never, Until never you chase find a crab. the submarine. Never chase a crab. The submarine. The submarine mm-hmm. is why points are important. Because a submarine will spawn on the map mm-hmm. when you have when you reach 30,000 points. Yep. Yeah. And what the submarine does is replaces... Never, never I'm just shocked that. with my knowledge of this. Like, yeah, I know no, that. You're, you're on board. I know this. I love you, this. I, am obs- I was obsessed with this I'm game. I'm so glad that you're yeah, here. Because if you weren't here... Because I can tell in Tyler's face he just, doesn't Tyler like does it. not like this game. No. I can tell. Mm-hmm. Frowny face uh, Tyler over I know. here. Mm-hmm. And I'm just all smiles. I'm like, <laughs> I know. I'm thinking about sitting in the basement in my bum equipment sweatshirt and like... <laughs> and your fin. Just freaking wearing- playing this game. <laughs> I didn't have the fin yet. That was later in life. But I would love this place. Hyper color scrunchie. Just having a hey, good time. Loved my scrunchies. <laughs> I'd still wear scrunchies if they were cool. <laughs> That's okay though. I don't care. Anyway, cool. sorry. We don't care. We're not talking cool. about yeah, scrunchies. You can wear. You can wear them next time. It's fine. I will wear a scrunchie, scrunchie next time and a bum equipment and a sweatshirt if you'd like me to. <laughs> and a fin. Please. And a fin. Yeah. I'm in for the fin. <laughs> I didn't mean to make a rhyme. That was. I'm in. That was fin. good. I'm in for the fin. That was, you're in. So <laughs> the submarine. So the submarine. <laughs> essentially, just. You just switch out. Yeah. Instead of being Scuba Steve, you're a submarine. You're a submarine, yeah. And maybe he's in the submarine. It's, it's one would like to think. We would like to think. Although he's in. shrink down a although, little right, bit. The it's, a, it's a one-man submarine <laughs> suit. <laughs> well, okay, the one-man submarine I can buy, right? Yeah, because absolutely. those exist. Those exist. That's. I think they have one. They use one in the first Jaws movie. Yeah. But, but what's weird is. Oh my God, they do. The the submarine is actually smaller than the scuba diver. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it is. So. So maybe he's like controlling it from up top, you know? Yeah, maybe. maybe something let's, like that. Let's just maybe, let's, maybe him and Kevin yeah, Costner right. are setting up there and they've okay. got their controls. Mystery solved. Absolutely. <laughs> Done. Mystery solved. It gives you an extra. We hit. just broke the code on Jaws. I'm just letting you know. We know everything about it now. I, I think we're qualified to write a fact. I want to yeah. update their Wikipedia. The fact was, very, oh, fact was very small. Very small. Because I like the when music. he drops down. When he drops down, and he's, I love that. That's my favorite. <laughs> That's my favorite, and then the the sound that the the um I'm losing the my train of thought that you thought was shooting out of his eyes. The, the harpoon gun, the harpoon, or whatever. Yeah, that one. Bing, bing, bing. It's it's great. It's so great. <laughs> the game is maybe not that high pitched. The game is pretty good. It's great pretty, game. It's pretty pretty. It good. was it it was entertaining. Okay, uh-huh. I'll take entertaining. It was entertaining. Uh-huh. I take but entertaining. I would have. I I started it today and I beat it today. Yeah, yeah it's a, not hard. No, no, no. It took me about an uh, an hour. There's yeah. many video, like when I was just brushing up on it because it's been so long that I played. There's many uh, YouTube videos where that people are beating it in like seven minutes. Speed runs. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, it's not it's not hard. It's not like yeah. I thought it was all it was all pretty game. smooth sailing. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I like what you did there. <laughs> Kevin Costner is smiling wherever he's at right now. <laughs> he's smiling down from heaven. Because <laughs> I like, the, I mean, I don't like to think he's dead, but I mean, oh I mean, he, poor dead Kevin dead? Costner. No, he's, he, I think he's. <laughs> he's got a movie. No, 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 he's not dead. Coming out, oh. yeah, like an action movie or something. Yeah. Right? He's Literally, trying to go the action hero oh, route. Because that's because that's yeah. who I know. That's who we need a guy in his. <laughs> yeah. Kevin Costner in his fifties doing an action movie. Literally, Kevin the last Costner, one I watched. If you're listening, we're really we, sorry. We're really sorry, Kevin. We really sorry. We need your endorsement. I enjoyed you. I'm waiting for Field of Dreams too. Still, Field of Dreams too. Yeah. The last Kevin Costner movie I saw, and please, I know I'm going to reference Friends again too, but it was Rumor Has It because Jen Aniston is in it. I don't, I didn't and know. it's what based loosely on Miss Robertson. It's oh, okay. it's based on that, and he bangs her mom, and he's banged the grandmother, and then he ends up banging her Jennifer Aniston. She's the daughter. So he's a winner. He wins in that movie because <laughs> he's banging he's three very attractive ladies. Uh, I can't off the top of my head. I cannot think of who he doesn't bang the anyone was. in the Jaws video game. No, know. he does not. <laughs> I don't think he's really there. I think that's something we've imagined. <laughs> but I thought it was all it was it was pretty good until the actual Jaws fight at the very end. Oh man, I thought that was that was awful. And it's tough. It is. It is tough. Yeah. Tell me how you get. Tell me how you get to Jaws. Because it suddenly yeah. right? switches to a first-person perspective. And how, yes. how do you make that happen? Well, you finally, you get your power level high enough yep. that mm-hmm. you can kill Jaws before the level ends. Yes. Or, or get, get Jaws' life down to Yeah, and you have to, to take zero. his power mm-hmm. level down. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
And then once you do that, which is basically shooting him repeatedly, yes, just over and over. It takes it takes so many days. Going under hits. him and going over him and doing yeah, yeah, yeah and, all this and, and you know the trick, right? I'm sure go, you know the trick. Going like through the screen. Well, there's if you go to the very very yeah. top of the surface. That's, I know that's not the term for it. But. Jaws, <laughs> Jaws can <laughs> Jaws can never get you. That's true. Never yes. get you if you're at the very top. Very top, he cannot. I don't get know you if that was an oversight or if that's like <laughs> that's the secret. Yeah, that's the secret of Jaws. Oh yeah, I forgot about. But that. first person, you're the ship. And you can ram the ship just a little bit. So you have to wait until Jaws gets close enough. Yeah. And then you flash your strobe strobe light at him. Yeah. Makes him jump Jaws up. Jaws jumps yeah, up. Yeah, he jumps. And yeah. then you stab him with the bow of the ship. Which yeah. Jaws might, was Jaws female in this movie? I can't remember. Cause it, I thought oh, she. Oh, was it Jaws I, 3? I thought when, it was always female. It's always female? I thought, okay. I, I, mm. Don't get mad at me, listeners, if I'm incorrect. Yeah, I don't, I don't, yeah, that's I what apologize. I'm worried about. I'm worried fish, about. Fish don't be girls, eh? <laughs> fish be fish. I'm, I'm worried about the, well, I mean, the backlash we're going to get from is, Kevin Costner fans. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Kevin Costner fans are going to be <laughs> oh, on Oh, they this. are going to be mad. <laughs> be on this show. <laughs> and I'm also worried about, I mean, I want to be I mean, sensitive usually, to I the mean, gender of the is, shark. <laughs> totally me. No, I have no clue. I have no marine biology backing. What? But what? Just, <laughs> and no. the, and the landlocked you know, Tennessee. No. <laughs> you know any marine biologists? I think Taryn went to marine biology. Taryn went to marine biology school. But usually our... Taryn's our, been a lot in Dave concerts. <laughs> I'm sure she's a marine she biologist. She about fish. Yeah. Um, no, they... Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure you're, you're vicious... Sharks are usually females. Yeah, they're like the lions. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yes, like exactly. The female lions will go I, can, out. I do know a yeah. marine biology person. If we need to call a phone a friend, can can you ask your they marine can, biology person to call in? Have them for call next in episode? next week. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I can phone, we can phone a friend. <laughs> She's great. Uh, she might be really pissed when you're like, uh, "Is Jaws a boy or a girl?" <laughs> Hey, I know. I, I know it's twelve thirty. I know it's twelve thirty nine. It's Jaws a boy or a girl? <laughs> she wouldn't care. She would not care at all. I realize she, you're a professional. This chick has however. actually like. I have to get up early in the morning to do <laughs> yeah. marine biology things. <laughs> She, I mean, she's been to like South Africa and stuff studying sharks. I mean, she knows what's up. Sharks are her forte, so she probably would know. Okay, all right. I will ask, ask her, her to call. I will ask okay. her. But you see, you have three strobe lights, mm -hmm. and you have to just Jaws has to be like right up on your ship to be able to do mm -hmm. it. But you also, he's constantly he she. Right. Jaws is moving constantly <laughs> moving left to right, mm -hmm. but you can't catch Jaws. Like you can keep moving over the left, yeah. and you per perpetually go left and never catch. Yeah. Catch up. So there's no. Moving to the left and right is just nothing. You just have to wait, and hopefully by the time Jaws swims back and forth that you'll get close enough to, to throw up the strobe yeah. and Make stab him jump. Jaws. Make and him and the him. pixel that you have to get to get Jaws is like one pixel slightly off-center. Mm -hmm. So it's even if you get it, you have to be like right dead on to actually get Jaws. It you took got it. me to me. That what are you was bitching the, about? You got that it. Was the yeah. What are you bitching about? I mean, it can't be that hard. There it is. It can't be that hard, Tyler. Ding, you ding, got it. We have a winner. <laughs> it was it was fun until it was frustrating. Uh, it, yeah. <laughs> well, what happens if you don't stab Jaws? Shit starts all over again. Yeah. All over. Yeah. 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 You keep your power level. Yep. Yeah. But Jaws regenerates yep. Wolverine style. Wolverine. Completely. 100%. Yeah. Are you happy that I knew about Wolverine? I mean, <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Just slowly <laughs> drag from your upper Bring crust. Bring me the upper crust. Abercrombie root. Hey, you know, I, ne I was down. not an Abercrombie it, fan. Don't put me in there. It almost makes up for you not wearing the fin. I'm really sorry like it's like, that I didn't like wear the fin. It, it almost makes up for You know, it. I even thought about it. I was like, where is that Jimmy Buffett fin? I could wear it. <laughs> and then I was like, no, they're already getting this t-shirt that I have on, which All I know right. no one can see. We went through several. Tell us about the shirt. Talking about your, you know, I what you were going to wear. I did. I was like, I'm going to need a wardrobe change because I wanted to wear my Slytherin shirt because that is me. And then I was like, oh, no. With video game shirt, I'm wearing Billy Mitchell. It's happening. But yeah, we'll she, talk it made that. it sound like a fragrance. <laughs> I'm I wearing like, Billy Mitchell. I don't even want to imagine what Billy Mitchell smells like. Freaking hot sauce and pomade with that long ass hair. <laughs> Two week old chili. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Because oh, God. God, I hate Billy Mitchell. I hate him so much. For a guy I don't know, Do I've want, only seen him one movie. I hate him. I ha I hated him from the minute he was on the screen. I'm sorry, we are so getting off Jaws, but don't get me started on this <laughs> if we're not going to talk about it. <laughs> yeah. It right. is a short game. It is a very it's short game. All we have to talk about it just pretty much. You stab Jaws, and then suddenly it's the plane yeah. flying off into pink. That's exactly. It. And, and the sunset. And the, the sunset. End. And there's the, the beautiful sunset. music again. Yeah. And you there's get, beautiful music and you again get at the end. And it looks like a postcard. I got to say, man, for... A game of this time, it's pretty rare that you actually get something like that. Yeah. Instead of like a black like, screen. Like, doesn't it that just says, say game over? You beat the or game. You beat Congratulations. It. Congrats. 
Thanks for your money. You Bonk. get you get a freaking postcard view right. of the ocean. What are you in the complaining boat? about? What are Shut you complaining up, Tyrone. About? God, you're such an asshole. Shut your face. <laughs> God, I'm over it. No, I'm just kidding. Let's go meet some girls at Block. Can we talk about Billy Mitchell real he, quick? Because yeah. I just got it fired <laughs> yeah, up yeah, in yeah, my brain. Okay. okay, so they can't see, but I do have on. I got to visit the King of Kong uh, arcade Cock. in Orlando, Florida. Right, the Cock Arcade. <laughs> the yeah, cock, right. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, there's actually one in the airport too, in the Orlando airport. That. Yes, and um, that's the, that's where I was at. And then I we got the the shirt was given to me, and it's signed by Billy Mitchell. And then it just it says never surrender never <laughs> Billy Mitchell Fucking and Billy I was Mitchell. so I had a, a friend of mine and we I've talked to you about him before that said you got to watch this even if you don't care about video games or never have cared about video games in your life it is a fabulous documentary about well, I mean these people know I don't have to explain what it is this mm. <laughs> this is the target audience That's some some people listening well, may, may not it's know it's about the two gentlemen that go back and forth for the high score of Donkey Kong mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and. It, you just get so invested in it because you totally have the villain and then you totally have the good guy with the big heart and the family mm. and you just want to rip that fucking man. Billy Mitchell's teeth out yeah. of his head. Do you think... Like, he is awful. When and you met him... Cheater, when you met him, like, did you pick up that vibe? Or like, I mean, so it's not tool. just like made up like that in the documentary no, I, like, I mean, to make I, it exciting? I think he lives his everyday life like that. Yeah. Like I'm pretty sure because there's a part in the in the film we were just talking about it before we started where he goes to like a big box store like a Costco or a Sam's or something right. and he moves all the name brand hot sauce like your Franks and your Tabasco and he puts his like shitty Orlando Florida <laughs> hot sauce in front of it and he's just there laughing with his American flag tie and his long hair <laughs> and he's awful and then I think the the part where I hated him the most is where he sent his little minions to Steve Weeby's house. To check out his his yeah, machine, right? Yeah. And they saw the box from the guy that doesn't like Billy Mitchell. That had just sent him some parts. They weren't tampered with or anything mm-hmm. like that. And then the guy who has the, the record on Missile Command. Missile Command. That's right. I could, I was trying to think of the name. And then Billy uh, Mitchell is like, oh yeah, he calls the gamer people. He's like, this guy's a cheater. This guy's a cheater. And then he won't even come and play live. He sends them a fucking video videotape. Tape. Yeah. And I, I just, oh, I was infuriated. Yeah, like, no. I wish you could have seen me watching this. It was like I was watching something so hard hitting <laughs> and just so dramatic. And I'm sitting, when Steve uh, Weeby's tearing up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I was bawling. I was bawling like a baby. The documentary is really good. It's amazing. Like, I mean, they do a really good yeah. job of like making you. Even if you don't know uh, anything about it, like, you, it's exactly can, like, you connect it's with exactly the character. What, yeah, yeah, like it, yeah. that's what they. That's what my friend had told me. He was like, even if you never touch Donkey Kong, you don't care anything about video games. You're going to be so invested in these two characters, and you they're are. Like, they're it's Voldemort nuts. and Harry Potter. They're exactly, hundred percent. You want to rip <laughs> Billy Mitchell's big old hair off, like oh. But yeah, it was um, the arcades neat, and they have, of course, they their feature game is Donkey Kong. Uh, but they had a ton of stuff. <laughs> Their feature game is Murder Time. <laughs> it's a, yeah. Oh man! But and the, oh, and I cried too because at the end, the the little old lady in it that plays Cubert, and that was the nicest. Mm-hmm. The only thing that Billy Mitchell did nice in it was he sent the lady the Cubert machine. Yeah. So he could practice, so she could practice, and she dies at the end. And now neither one of them hold the record. Mm-hmm. It's like the very a very young Chinese kid, mm-hmm. right? From yep. like doesn't not an American because it like Steve Weeby like, in China. is in uh, Guinness Book of World Records, but then there's like an addendum like yeah recently after this was printed. after this yeah. Right. yeah yeah but neither one of them hold it now yeah they can't touch. are you up for the challenge oh Taryn? boy <laughs> what's the challenge are you are you a bad enough dude to set the high score yeah. oh to do the Donkey Kong uh-huh. challenge yeah it's hard it and is the, yeah, it's fucking so hard. hard don't make uh, I've played at Dave and Buster's before just because you know I was like oh I'd play Donkey Kong and I couldn't even get past the first screen yeah. no, I'm like, no no can't do no, it no, no I can't do it either I, I can freaking get, barrels like, I did have. I get I, three stages in. That's it. Yeah, that's, that's it. pretty good. I host. Um, you're the best Donkey Kong player I know. Then <laughs> yeah, that's congratulations. Good. You're the best one I know. <laughs> you're on my top list. You want my T-shirt? You can have it. Um, that now and please correct me if I'm wrong, but we don't know what we're talking about. Okay, we can't, we can't do well, that. Well, it's a gamer question. Yeah. Um, well, <laughs> well, is that not the first place that Mario appears? In Donkey, In Donkey Kong. Kong. In Donkey Kong. Yeah. Right. Okay. I, I did so. that as a trivia. I host trivia at my restaurant. On Monday nights during okay. Monday Night Football. Um, do I need to say where so I work? Is, that, you, you is can, that a question? You can play yourself. That's oh, fine. yeah. But that that was a question I had one night was what video game did Mario first appear? And it's Donkey Kong. Mm-hmm. See, I know some <laughs> games. You're on no, it. I'm just kidding. With, You're on with it. his then girlfriend, Paulette. Yes. Who was later replaced by, by Princess Peach. Princess Peach, yes. 
See? I've got some achievements for Jaws, though. You have some achievements oh. for Jaws, achievements Tyler? For Jaws. I'm ready. The first one being, I'm giving it all she's got, Captain. Okay. And you unlock that by maxing out your power level. Yes. See, I've got that as an achievement as well. I'm giving it all well, she's got, it. Captain. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> See? I called it. It's over 9,000. <gasps> okay. okay. Good Dragon Ball Z reference. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Which I barely get because I didn't watch it. So we got to have to watch it. Yeah. No, I'm not going to do that because it's no. bad. I'm I'm going on the record. That's a bad anime. Yeah, it's it's, it's a parody that a lot of kids didn't I'm, realize. It's worth was a watching. Gonna look behind me. It's again. worth watching ironically <laughs> now. <laughs> oh yeah, I do know what that is. I've just never the other one. Uh, Don't bother. Number two okay. being what? It's a life skill, and you get that by killing twenty five jellyfish in the bonus level. Oh, that is. I don't remember that's, that. That's that's like the maximum number of jellyfish. Ooh. Yeah, there you go. That's crazy. So you got them all. Uh, I only got. 18 was the highest oh, okay. I cut. I think, okay. yeah. So. I, I didn't get very much than that. Uh, you got more? Wow. The last one Whoa. being for Steve Irwin. And as you kill <laughs> Damn a, it, you, you motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. Wow. All right, what is it? What do you got? You kill 100 stingrays. Oh, look <gasps> at my notes. All right, except I've got a better name. My my achievement name is Crikey. <laughs> oh, I like his better. <laughs> but they're both good. Nice. Defeat 100 wow. stingrays. Wow, 100 stingrays. <laughs> there it is. There's the proof. Oh. <laughs> the only other one that I had... <laughs> <laughs> Asshole is smile, you son of a bitch, which you don't get. Which because you've might. never seen the movie. <laughs> nope. My dad didn't love me. Nope. No one no one wrote anything down about we might need a bigger boat. I mean, that would have been a great achievement. Uh, and he's not gonna get that either. But, but you got, you know, yeah. you haven't done your achievements yet. So is oh, that is well, that I mean, yours? This <laughs> should be mine. Yeah, we're gonna need a bigger boat. <laughs> that needs to be my achievement. <laughs> I don't know what that, what the pri- what you have to do to achieve it, though. Uh, if you set an achievement, don't you have to get to it? Well, see, that's what yeah. you just call yours when you max your boat out. Okay. Has yeah, we could be, do that. Right? Yeah. The only other one I had is good one, Ringo. Oh, yeah. And that's when you get the, the yellow submarine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I think I think Ringo. I do. I like the Steve Bird one, Irwin ones. <laughs> Man, we were on point. Yeah. It's like, that was like yeah, one mine. Like I see it. I that. see it coming together <laughs> right here. I love it. Tyler. I think- yes, Dave. I had more fun than you, than you did, I'm sure, playing this game. Um, I had fun recording. The I'm going to go well, buy that's it. Good. That's good, yeah. <laughs> again, and play it again. Maybe Darcy Smith's mother will let me come sit in her basement <laughs> and play it. I think you, Darcy, yeah. Jen Aniston, and your marine biologist friend Believe- should all get together Listen. and play Jaws. Listen, <laughs> if Jen Aniston a- comes <laughs> hang out with me, we're not playing fucking video games. I'm going to pull out. What if she comes over just like, I heard you have Jaws. I, heard, <laughs> I would really like to play I Jaws. I heard you want to play Jaws, Taryn. I'd be like, oh, I got some chomping I want to do, and it's not... On the fish game. I, I want to play Jaws and tell you guys what an asshole John Mayer is. That's what oh, we're going to do tonight. That's what we would talk about, because he is. I'd like to throw a bottle at him, too. <laughs> oh, oh sorry. sorry. I didn't. I, no, no. We should, we should flesh out that. We'll flesh, we'll flesh out that story just in a, that's in fine. a moment. That's fine. Tyler. Yes, Dave. If you were to give this game a beard that just sums up everything that Jaws is, this something is about. something y'all do? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. It's a little segment. I, I, I wondered what that was when I was listening to him earlier. I was like, okay, I, I'll get it when maybe when I hear him. All right. Okay. For ever, for for anyone who doesn't know, mm-hmm. we don't like to give numbers. You don't. You, you like, give like, beards. We give we give beards and glasses. I freaking love mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. because numbers are just <laughs> yeah. Right. Taryn's pointing at her face. <laughs> right. She's pointing at Tyler's beard Beard-ed and my glasses. glasses. <laughs> so clever. <laughs> we're we're too good for numbers. Mm-hmm. You're let's definitely just, let's too just good be honest. Numbers. Plus, we don't really know them well. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, we do know beards and we do know glasses. Okay. To Tyler, mm-hmm. if you were to give this game a beard. That just encapsulates everything it's about. What kind of beard would that be? Uh, once in college, I went to a talk where the surgeon, the chief of surgery at Louisville, came down and gave a talk about the first successful face transplant. Oh, yeah. So this this is a very grisly beard. I'm yeah, there's your show notes material right there. So I'm giving this. the A Russian girl had the majority of her face ripped off by a wheat thresher. <gasps> And they had to get her a new face uh-huh. and transplant onto her face. Okay. So I'm giving this game the Russian girl's face hanging off by her chin. Okay. So it's a, Good it's God, a, that's <laughs> graphic. It's a, it's a face beard. All right. Because it's, it's what a shark would do. Right. Okay. Okay. All right. I get the connection. I mean, I don't know. I don't even know where to go from there. <laughs> that's graphic. That's, yeah, that's I told you. Told you. That's pretty. That's graphic. as bad as the boot in the mud. That's graphic. I'm, I'm gonna need to pause. It's graphic. <laughs> that is graphic. Tyler. Yes, Dave. Um, you don't wear glasses, but I do. I do. Um, Taryn does. I do. They're in my mm. my bag. So 
I've only seen them at nighttime. I never see only when you go to bed do I ever see I glasses. almost put them on, but I'm not reading anything right now, so I don't, you know. Well, we could do um we can do a reading if you want to put them on. Okay, I'm I can. If you want me to. I'm yeah. fine with that. That's fine. I'll put them on. Um do they have glasses in Waterworld? I don't know. They shouldn't. Why would you need glasses? <laughs> to read all those books. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tyler, if you were to give this game a pair of glasses, uh what kind of glasses would you give it? Samuel L. Jackson's Ooh. just broken and bloody glasses from Jurassic Park. <sighs> okay. Hold on to your butts. Oh, yeah. Did, yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> wow. I like the rating system a lot. We're we're partial. I'm to totally it. We're partial on board to with it. that. I'm glad because I love beards. Mm-hmm. I, I like Tyler's. I love the red. Tyler's got a very good much. It's very nice. You got a good My brown hair and red beard. I do. I love the red beard. I like beards a lot. I think those are making a huge comeback in the past last year or two. We're getting rare. We're dying out. No, I think the red. The red. Jeans you don't live in hipster Nashville out. like I do. And the beards are all there. <laughs> uh, the beards are there. Even the lesbians covering up for the the gay boys too. Um, and then I just acquired glasses last summer, so I'm definitely on board with the glasses. And mine are yellow. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> so no, we're we're pushing time here. We are. So What's your time? Right at the end. We, we try to get it in an hour. Mm-hmm. Okay. Which we're at right now. Plus or minus 10 usually. So yeah. okay. we got a little bit a little bit longer. Okay. But I'll flesh out the reference real quick because you made it. People who are a fan of Ryan Adams. Oh, boy. Might know Taryn. <laughs> she is rather notorious. You won't know me. You might for, know what I you did. You might know what she did. She's notorious for shutting down a concert in Nashville. Oh, shit. Now, now what exactly happened, Taryn? Um, well, the the backstory and very quickly, I had, I had given, and I feel like I'm, being a bitch about Ryan Adams. I love Ryan Adams' music. I'll just preface it by that. He writes some great tunes. And I, lo- I love some of his old stuff. And even some of his new stuff. Um, but I had given him several hundred dollars of my money and several concert attempts to go and hear an okay Ryan Adams show. Mm-hmm. And by the time I went to Knoxville and another one in Nashville and blah, blah, blah. Uh, if you've ever been to Nashville, Tennessee, the best venue on the planet is the Ryman Auditorium. Uh, it's an old church. Um, it was built f- with, you know, of course, without power, without electricity. So its acoustics are amazing. And they announced that Ryan Adams was doing a show there, which he had done in the past. And I went to the show. And just like the past show I had seen in Knoxville, he comes out, he plays a couple Grateful Dead songs. He lets the girl in his band sing four or five songs. I mean, like, I, that's fine if I was had not paid, like, 80 or $90 to hear some really good Ryan Adams. Like, mm. I want that druggy, drunk, heartbroken Ryan Adams, and this was just shit. Mm. And I know Ryan Adams fans will disagree with me. That's fine, whatever. Um, so I had... I was really intoxicated. <laughs> <laughs> Very intoxicated. And from what the paper said, it, they said I threw it at him. I did not throw it at him. <laughs> I was uh, privy enough to be second row at this show. And very close. And I had snuck in a half pint of Jack Daniels. And it was a little glass one. And I, in my drunken stupor, thought, (laughs) all Ryan Adams needs is a drink, man. Because sober Ryan Adams sucks. (laughs) And I just straight, I went like this. And I I know they can't see that. But I just barely gave it a little nudge, just a little toss. And I'll be damned if it didn't hit the corner of a speaker and shacked her <laughs> all over the stage. Now, go back a year before, Nashville had already been in the news about Ryan Adams because a fan kept shouting, shouting at him to play Summer of 69, which, of course, is a Brian Adams song. <laughs> and he... He walked That's into his dad, the crowd. Right? Yeah, it's his dad. Yeah. No. Uh, he walked into the crowd and handed the fan like 40 bucks and said, Get the fuck out of my concert. So Nashville had already been on the map for pissing off Ryan Adams. Yeah. And then flash forward to a year later, and here I am. And he stops the show and he has an attitude about Nashville. He says it's all rich college kids, which uh, okay. a lot of it is. Well, see, that's my question yeah. was going to be like, clearly he has yeah. something. He's got he's a, got he's got a grudge. Nashville. He's got a chip on his shoulder about right. Nashville because he lived there through a bit of his druggy stage, if I'm not mistaken. And he's probably got his heart broken there or something. And, you know, he probably wrote some really good songs and he didn't play them at the Ryman that night. Um, <laughs> too so close. It's too close. I, as I am literally physically, and I'm not, they can't, I know they can't see me, but I'm not a very big person. I'm pretty mm-hmm. short. And, they are physically picking me up and escorting me out of the Ryman, <laughs> like feet dangling. <laughs> and um, he gets on the mic and he says, I guess it didn't sound good on her fucking yacht. 
<laughs> and that was the name of the game. So the next day, this is that ties how, in the jaws. Yeah, I like that. Absolutely. It comes back. It gets, comes back around. <laughs> but the next day, your friend and my friend and everybody's friend Brandon goes, "You have to get on UFCK. They are all talking about you." <laughs> and they didn't know it was me. They just right. had read the reports that someone threw a bottle. And that's the day I got kicked off of UFCK because <laughs> I went on there and said, it, yeah, it was me. It sucked. And I was trying to give him a drink, and I apologize, and they kicked me off. Mm. That's okay, though. Well, hopefully they're all listening to this show. I yeah. hope they are. <laughs> and now they know. They yeah. know the real deal. We're big on the Bri- <laughs> Brian, <laughs> Brian Adam. Brian, he no, does no, not like no, to be called we're Brian We're bigger on Brian Adams. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're trying to break Which into is, the Ryan Adams fandom. Yeah, it's absolutely <laughs> shocking to me that Ryan Adams is married to American teen dream sweetheart Mandy Moore. Like, that just blows my I mind. I didn't know that. He's married that to either. Mandy Moore. Hmm. He is married to Mandy Moore. Weirdo Ryan Adams with his crazy hair and his tight girl jeans, is married to Mandy In my Moore. mind, Mandy Moore is just always pining after Zach Braff. Yep. Always. I'm with so, you. Yes. Just, I'm with you. <laughs> Absolutely. Or I go I go to the Entourage it's, reference, too, because she dates. So will Megalix. Or Megalix will appreciate that Scrubs reference. The Scrubs reference. reference. Oh, is that's that, a, that's we got a, a Scrubs fan? Yeah, it's a deep cut. Yeah. Oh. All right. Got people to thank. We got people to thank. Let's do it. Thank the people. Lord, uh, so for Twitter, Twitter comes coming first. There are more. Well, Twitter's, yeah. It's blown far, up. Yeah, it's blown, blown up. up. It's crazy. Uh, Lord Dennis, Flautus Chandra. Exalted Lord Mike, Marques Nicole, and Impresario Tony. Uh, for Facebook, Exalted Lord Micah. Exalted Lord Micah, Exalted Lord Mike. Yeah, wow, well, well, that was weird. Yeah. Hmm. Troubadour's Mega Elixir, Marques Nicole, St. Zach, and myself. Tyler. <laughs> myself. Holland. Me. Tyler I don't, Holland. I don't know who this Tyler Holland. Holland. Tyler Holland fellow is. Tummy Squirrel I, Rider. <laughs> tummy Squirrel Rider. <laughs> I want that squirrel. <laughs> that's like a that's like a gnome oh, name. <laughs> Tell yeah, me squirrel rider. <laughs> um, I actually I want to I know Tyler, you're not really you're not really Twitter centric. So I want to pass Huge something along. Twitter to centric you. right here. Yeah. I've got a suggestion for you for your, your unborn daughter's name. <gasps> okay. Someone someone oh. please don't name her someone tweet. Heard the call <laughs> <laughs> and Archivist Cute Butt uh. has suggested the following name. Parker, Rose, Sparkster, Stunt Race, FX, Holland. <laughs> I do yeah. like the name Parker. S- sold. And well, it is, it is Parker Rose. It is going to be Parker mm-hmm. Rose. See, I didn't know Unless that we hear something amazing Which, until then. This is pretty amazing. Like I, Megas had told all of our family and friends, don't embroider anything. It still could change. Well, th- so. But this is really good because yeah. like, his point is you really only use the middle name when you're, when you're angry. Mm-hmm. And these are things that you don't like. Sparkster, Sparkster. Stunt race FX. She, she so. knows when I call her Sparks and she's just, that's it. that's it. That kid's going to the curb. <laughs> I, I'm also really proud. I, I don't think we talked about this, but Michael Winslow retweeted Lord Exalted Lord Mike's request that he call in to the Tadpog Hotline. <laughs> really? So that's pretty cool. I did. I just heard that, that on the that he they were going to tweet him. That's our brush. That was with, one that's I our brush to. with fame. Yep. That's, that's, brush with fame. That's it. Thank you. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna tweet the shit out of this, by the way. Please do. I can't please, wait. And if you could like, uh, like I'll give you some some money if you want to just like bribe people to. Not, I don't to want tweet. money. You don't. You don't. But don't, like, not, but like the people oh, that we don't know, to right? Tweet it? Okay, <laughs> we can do that. Um, Joey of uh, Mega Elixir fame mm-hmm. and Archivist Cute Butt of Wayward Cross Comics fame uh, both answered my question. Um, do you remember in the Super Mario Brothers 2 episode I talk about I had this fucking red paperback book that talked about how to beat Super Mario Brothers 2? Mm-hmm. Uh, they both identified it. It's How to Win at Nintendo Games by oh, wow. Jeff Rovin. Uh, <laughs> and it brought back some crazy-ass memories when I looked it up on Amazon. I bet. They're like, if you want a copy, Taryn, yeah. you can go Amazon? on Amazon. It's like ninety nine dollars. That's all. Wow. Yeah. It's it's just ninety nine. It's, it's a fucking $99. steal. Let me get my pocketbook out. Uh, I'm willing to bet I could tweet Jeff Rovin and be like, "Hey, can I have that for twenty dollars?" Yeah. <laughs> you could bribe someone on Amazon for cheaper than that. Um, also, I want to. I'm, I'm plugging a bunch of shit, mm-hmm. but there's something that I, that I really need to plug. Lord Dennis, he did an awesome shirt design for Threadless. Um, I love Threadless, oh, by man. the way. Threadless mm-hmm. is awesome. If they want to, Threadless, if you're Let's listening tweet. and you want to sponsor. I will tweet Threadless because I tweet them <laughs> sometimes. Yeah. Yes. Please. I mean, I'm I, in I it. love Threadless. They need to make you guys a shirt. Um, Dennis and I, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. we both went to Murray together as graphic design students. Uh, he has got, he's been submitting a lot of shirts, 
Uh, but I wanted to take just just a minute and plug this one because uh, this shirt is amazing. Um, if you're listening to this when it drops on Monday, if you could check the show notes, uh, it, we'll put a link in there to his shirt. Rate it a five so I can fucking buy the thing. Right. Because uh, I really want to buy it. Mm. That's it. This You're doing it for me. What's the shirt? Um, it is... Uh, what do you call like? Is it like a baseball shirt where with it's the like, sleeves? Yeah, it's yeah, got it's sleeves baseball, and it's a yeah. different color. Yep. The sleeves are red, and yeah. he's got like this um, mock uh, Soviet propaganda poster, yeah. which says, "I have red armies." Got referencing, it. Referencing the, the sleeves on the nice. shirt. Yeah. Nice. It's pretty good. Check I it like out, that. please. I please like check that. It out. Okay. Tear anything you want to plug? Give your Twitter plug, handle. Yeah, yeah, please. Well, I'm, I'm actually, I'm pretty funny on it. I'm not tooting my own horn, but I, I'm a little. I'm, uh, I can I'm be. Not too far no, I'm not too far I work it's eighty percent Jaws tweets. It's you know? all Jaws and Kevin Costner, of course. Um, no, I, um, I can be a little bit more free on my Twitter yeah. than I can on my Facebook because I run a lot of stuff from my store on my Facebook. Mm. Um, did I say where I worked at? No. Mm-mm. I work for Hooters. Hells yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Chicken so, wings. If you want to go <laughs> yes. be weird and you're uh, in Nashville. Yeah, uh, come on in, man. Just, uh, you, no, you I know love all it. kinds of you know like, intimate yeah. details. You know about Terrence, all so. about me now. <laughs> um, no, I, I work for Hooters in Nashville, Tennessee. Um, they And I love it. Been with them almost 10 years. Um, but yeah, I, I can be a little bit more off color on my Twitter. Mm. And my Twitter is uh, T-A-R-Y-N-U-P-T-N. Tearing up Tennessee. Yeah. So get it. Get on there and get it. It's not, get yacht, you some it's not fun. yacht Girl. It's not Yacht Girl. No. It's not Ryan Adams, Jack Daniels, 42. No, it's not. It's not that at all. Uh, no, it's Tearing Up Tennessee. Please follow me. Thanks for listening, everybody. You can find the show on iTunes or Stitcher. So don't miss the next episode. It'll be Original Flavor Wednesday, and we're talking about IGN's 44th ranked game, Demon's Crest. While you're there, don't forget to subscribe. Give the show a five-star rating. Write a review. Write we a game them. you want us to do. It gets our attention. I'm we'll writing a review. Which, by the way, we, we have gotten the review uh, with the title Monster Madness. So we have to do that at some point. Okay. Um, we haven't forgotten. Or Monster Party? Monster Party. Yeah, Monster, Monster Madness. Monster Madness? Isn't think. that like Marble big Madness. trucks? Marble oh, Madness. My. Yeah. <laughs> I'm... I might have I might have mixed it up with a game that I actually would like to play, <laughs> which is Marble right Madness. Marble Madness. Madness? Marble yeah. Madness is not a great game, but I'd rather right? play it than Monster Party. So. Right? Oh, man, Monster Party's rough. Okay, but yeah, that's thanks. All right, guys. Uh, like Tyler said, we will be back next week. In the meantime, if you can't get enough Tadpog goodness, uh, please go to tadpog.com. That's where the show notes are. Um, you'll you'll see cool shit. I promise. You'll pr- we've made. The friends references have been made. Oh. There'll be links to to that on. Can there. I correct you real quick on your friends mess up? Yeah, yes, off of yes, that, yes, I've got to do it. Do so it, he, please. the one where Josh dies. You guys mm-hmm. name the one where Josh dies. Mm-hmm. And Tyler says there's only the, all the friends episodes are all titled the one where this, the one where that, right, blah blah right. blah blah. There's two that are not mm. the one <laughs> with, and it's the pilot, mm-hmm. of course, and then the finale Finale's is called the finale. last one. Uh, so you were incorrect, got me, Tyler. Got me. Got me. The only man that can challenge me on French trivia is sitting right here. Yeah, the I, only and one. And it's Tyler. It's not me. Like if you, <laughs> yeah, it's not. It's definitely Brad, Tyler. So. Um, if you all could just do a whole podcast of Tyler and I playing French trivia, we will tap into a whole other group. I'm fine with that. You gave okay. me that French trivia computer game. I so did. We could just, yeah. we could just play that. Just, it's a game. I have the PlayStation game. It's a game. <laughs> all right. I have it. Next time you're on. Uh, that's me. Next time you're on. French I'll, trivia. I'll sit quietly. Yeah. Just and just every now and then I'll just make tell a, a little masturbation quip. story. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's like, you know, it's funny that it's you funny. guys talk about Chandler yeah. because uh, I masturbated you, to Chandler. Right. It's weird. <laughs> you, right. Don't judge me. We will bring up. The, I saw him uh, at a blockbuster. I saw him at a blockbuster. <laughs> I went crazy. I couldn't help it. Talk about our call situation. <clears throat> Let's talk about our call situation. So I think we talked about. We've taken a lot of uh, input, uh, just r- running the gamut on what people think. But what you do with the calls, right? So I feel like uh, Dave and I've discussed it. And Got we'll, a solution. What we may do is we'll have a small number of calls, maybe like three calls, um, all all under three minutes. Yeah, yeah. So, like, this is a hint. If you if you call and you want your and you want your call to be played on the show, uh, it's gonna be best if you keep it under three minutes. Dang. Yeah. Because if it's over three minutes or if it's broken into two calls, it gets That's like some long winded. Yeah, yeah. Fans. It, 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 it gets it gets <laughs> yeah. rough. Not that I'm not a talker. <laughs> but but if if you keep it under three minutes and we like I like personally the ones where 
a question is asked mm-hmm. because I feel like that's super interactive, right? Yeah. Right. Like we get a chance to kind of talk back. And um, I, I also really like the ones where they're video game related because I feel like we're totally justified to play those on the show. Mm-hmm. And no one can say, eh, you know, it's not, it's a video game podcast. I'm not listening yeah. to. You know, and we don't mind if you throw in tangents and things like that. No, but, I love right. That. Yeah, no. just three minutes. Uh, questions get preference. You know, say whatever you know you want to say. We always appreciate feedback and talks and tangents. But you know, three minutes question, video game related in mm-hmm. some form or fashion, uh, and we'll try to keep it to like three or any drunk, any drunk yes, dials. That's the exception. <laughs> we're, keep, we're keeping drunk dials for sure and wrong. Drunk numbers. dials. Yep. Can I yeah. drunk dial? You? Yes, please. Yes. Fantastic. Yes, please. I can't wait. Yes. We can preface it. Guys, remember Taryn? <laughs> Here she is. She's checking in with she's us. Drunk Let's see, Let's see what Taryn she's up to. Dr- hey drunk call of the week. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm no. watching Waterworld. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I rented Waterworld, but rented, can you even rent Waterworld? Wow, that just showed my age right there. 29, by the way. 29. Uh, if you want to call, even though we've just totally put this like strict, strict rules. Yeah, that was that a lot of rules. We're totally going to enforce. That's all me. That's You're all the rules podcast. Tyler, Tyler's he's the nice one. I'm the asshole. Clearly, You're the hammer. That's right. Um, Tyler's the sickle. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. uh, <laughs> together we are comrades. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> Uh, if you want to call, even though we just put all those restrictions on, you mm. can uh, at two seven zero eight eight three two five five five. Also, we're on Facebook. Mm-hmm. You can find us at facebook.com slash tadpog. There's a lot of cool people doing a lot of cool shit. Um, Sandwich Squire, Phil, uh, just posted some creepy ass Vicky as the robot. Or, <laughs> yep. I'm sorry, robot Vicky as the final boss of Gradius. It's frightening. <laughs> yeah. It's frightening. Um, also, Exalted Lord Mike, he sent the the Tadpog Triforce tattoo design. So if anyone's... Have, do you have fans that have tattoos? Well, I'm sure that no. we do, but he he submitted. He's no, I meant fans have tattoos of, of your pop, of tad of our faces. <laughs> no, like of your permanently on yeah, their bodies. <laughs> <laughs> it's just Tyler and Dave. That's a lot of points. Yeah, a lot of tad They points. should win. They should just be your president <laughs> <laughs> if they have your face tattooed on. You know what? I'm all for it. If anyone wants to do it, I'm okay with it. I'd get mm-hmm. a tad bug tattoo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I just got a new tattoo. Friends one. What what was that? I have the Central Park coffee cup tattooed on me now. Really? Nice. Yep. Wow, that went way off. Can we put so. it in show notes? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Uh, we're also on Twitter. Twitter, Twitter Nation, strong. Woo, Twitter. Mm-hmm. You can follow us at Tadpog underscore podcast. It's cumbersome, but that motherfucker who's got the Tadpog mm-hmm. handle just ain't coming off it. Yep. Someone has your handle. They've got Tadpog. What a bitch. And they've made like You two, may shake them down tweets. Can you? I'll shake them down Do you know the Twitter people? <laughs> you don't even know what yeah? I can do All right, cool. <laughs> You don't even know <laughs> <laughs> I'm scrappy <laughs> Shake this Tad Pog guy down <laughs> um, Taryn Yes I've got a little quiz for you mm-hmm. Oh, I'm ready mm-hmm. Okay I told, oh, you, I told you there would be Is this about games? This well, sounded terrible No <laughs> Is this about games no. on the game podcast? It's about our intro song Oh, I did read about that Oh my gosh Where's it from? <laughs> don't tell me Okay because I read it at the bottom because I love it. And I love Meg's voice at the beginning. Oh, my God. I'm going to fail. I don't remember oh, what it's from. Um, it's from a game, right? No, no. No? Did you all make it? No. Did it start with an M? It does start yes, with an M. Yes, it starts You're with an right M. You're on the right track. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I don't remember. It's moves. Moves. Uh, that's it. I, I knew the M, though. And it's, it's you can yeah. the link. It's You can link to it. Where is where, where can they find at the, the link? At the bottom of the, of the whole page. Our song is played, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. It's called Moves. Yeah. yeah. The show notes. Yep. The show. I'm the show sorry. Notes. The show notes. <laughs> I didn't take my uh, internet. Uh, I didn't take my internet class uh, today. Uh, judges? It's at the bottom of the show notes. Yes. I, I've seen it but several who, times. Who does Moves? I have no idea. Sycamore Drive. Oh, okay. Sycamore Drive. That sounds like a, a road that might be right out here. <laughs> yep. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Is that a group? Is that a band? It's a it's guy. A dude in Scotland. Mm-hmm. Well, it sounds like a game music. Yeah. Yeah. It he does, like he does, does all like original Chip tunes and oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. it's really, really I good. I what chip tunes are. Hells yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm really pumped though. I'm happy to be here. Oh, well, no, very thank, glad. Thank, thank you, you for, for driving on up the show. and being on the show. I'm we so excited. It. Anytime I come home, this is my main priority, not my family. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, grandparents. <laughs> no, I'm really excited. I'm happy to be here. I'm glad Tyler and I got to talk about it and hang out with Dave and very pumped. Sweet. Thank you. No, yeah. Love having you on. Yay. Friends trivia, next one, boom. PlayStation. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know what game you said was next.
So until next, oh, do you have it? You were pointing at me like you wanted to say. No, something. I didn't. I was gonna. I thought you were gonna say what game is next. Demon's Crest. Demon's Crest. Okay. Demon's Crest. <laughs> 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 it sounds very interesting. <laughs> <laughs> We've got special guests, so definitely check in on us uh, on the Demon's Crest mm. episode. Is it Kevin Costner? It's better than Kevin Costner. Ooh. Yep. Yeah. It's better than <laughs> Kevin Costner. I will be here for that one. Yep. <laughs> so until next time, Tropical, Tropical Capricorn. Capricorn. I mean, it's not a hard guess. <laughs> the trollop of the group, obviously, is the one I slept with. <laughs> I never, I did There's not listen. There's your stinger. Yeah. <laughs>